AI tools like ChatGPT, Gemini are currently saying data in your website, but most website owners don't realize it and don't track this data. But you should track this. So in this video, I'm going to show you how can we track AI traffic in Google Analytics 4. And we can see data like how many visitors visit for AI, you know, like ChatGPT tools, and then how many revenue we generate with this uh, traffic. And also others AI like all of this, this is all of this most popular AI, for example, OpenAI uh, and also Gemini and GPT, all of this necessary AI filter will mm -hmm. create in here. So we can easily understand how many users visit from a specific AI tools and we also see this revenue. For example, if I extend this state in here 90 days, so I can see in here others AI tools report also. Okay. We can see in here Gemini and other say tools. So let's see how can we create this AI traffic uh, AI traffic report and how can we also pin this report in here like easily you just go to report and see in here like AI traffic how can you also do that. So just simply go to first your you have to go to first your Google Analytics 4 and then you have to go to library section reload library and then click in here create new report so click in here and then click on create detail report and click on traffic acquisition and turn off this chart go to here and click on here the plus icon click on source medium right in here source medium okay and then we'll see in here the session five minute channel group and all of this source but we only see in here we have to only um, we want to only see in here the ai traffic source not or not others traffic source so to filter just only ai traffic source we have to click in here add filter and then we have to click in here select dimension here traffic source and medium like uh, source session source and media and then in filter match type click in here and click on in there and then we have to go to this website underbem.com i write a blog post how can create this and also you can just simply we have to actually copy this so just click on here copy and it's automatically copy in your clipboard go to here again and by the way i add this link in the video description so we have to go to here and then we have to in value section paste in this what we are copy and click on apply okay so now we can see just only ai traffic source in here for example okay so it's perfect so now if i click in here save and i write this default name like AI traffic okay AI traffic and then I have to click in here save so okay perfect so now we easily create this AI traffic report easily in Google Analytics 4 but we want to pin this report like if I go to back and go to here like I, I not see any of this uh, report like like this like we want to also pin this report in google Analytics for report section too easy to access this report so to pin this report in here or to create this custom dashboard you have to go to library again and you have to go to click, click in here create new collection if you not have any collection i already have a collection so i just in here click on my existing collection and edit this so i'll create a new traffic in here which is uh, traffic source come here apply and make sure which report we was created like charts in here ai so we also see this report here ai traffic make sure you also drag and drop this report in here okay so now we create this collection and in this collection we collection uh, collection we 
drag and drop our AI traffic report and then click on here save so if you have a new report you just click here save as new collection but I want to save this is save this is my existing collection so I just click here save change to current collection so if I now go to back and if I now go to back you can see in here the AI traffic uh, another in this my custom dashboard another report add which is AI traffic so now uh, i can easily see how many traffic i get from ai also i also see this revenue conversion how many purchases i get through ai traffic like this and also the purchase revenue so i think this is helpful and if you want to create uh, this type of others if you want to also create this type of all of and this uh, all of this report like best selling product details report google ads report meta ads report also user behavior analysis report user take data report user demography data report like purchase rate by city country interest language so if you want to create this type of report you see my other video and or see my playlist which i create for gfo reporting i create a playlist and if you think like this is complex so you can easily uh, message me i can do th that for you i can create this beautiful report for you and also i create for you google local studio funnel visualization report and also other support for you and if you need any any tracking helps i can also help you with that so feel free to reach out me by our description link by our support my website so yep i think this will be helpful if this will be helpful so make sure to subscribe to this channel to support me okay so thanks thank you thanks for your time